Good morning, Royals. Today is October 7th, 2022. I'm Terry Mueller. And I'm Robert Watts. Today we will be bringing you the latest in school and community news. This, this is, is the, the Quartel, Quartel Update. Update. To get started, let's look at the weather with Nick. Thank you, Terry and Robert. Now let's take a look. As we can see, the highs are relatively the same until Sunday where it's going to drop in the 80s, but then the lows are going to stay in the 60s generally and in the high 50s. It's going to be pretty nice out, so no need for extra closing. Back for you guys. Thank you, Nick. Now moving to school announcements. Seniors, remember that your senior yearbook photos and baby photos are due by October 31st, 2022. If you do not have them submitted by then, they will not be going into the yearbook. Are you interested in playing softball for Quartz Hill High School? Well, there is an information meeting in room 222 on Tuesday, October 11th at 8 a.m. If you are interested, go to the coach's room, Denon in room 403. Hey, what have you heard about mock trial lately? I haven't heard much, but it seems pretty interesting. Yeah, I'm really interested in it too. I agree. Let's check that out. Course Hill's mock trial is gearing up for their upcoming competitive season. We took it upon ourselves to get their insight and their ambitions for the upcoming year. I'm here with Lauren. She's the president of Mock Trial. As the president of Mock Trial, what are you planning to offer to students who are interested? I think this year we really want to prioritize like making it a comfortable environment. Um, so we're gonna focus on doing like team building activities because it's hard to compete in this kind of environment if you're not friends. Um, outside of that, Obviously, the competitions themselves are available to anyone who's interested. Um, we're fundraising so that no one has like financial barriers involved. What are you hoping to accomplish here? Um, kind of just community. Uh, I think that's the most important part. Obviously, we want to win, but I think we're more impactful as a club if people feel comfortable coming here, and this is something they look forward to. So we're here with Abby, the vice president of Mock Trial. And what led you to join Mock Trial? Um, what led me to join Mock Trial was I actually want to go to law school. And um, last year I asked if Mock Trial gives you to that, like, takes you to that path of law school and like applying to become an attorney. And last year they said yes, and I was like, okay, I want to do this. I want to go in that path. How will this impact you? Um, I think this would impact me in a lot of ways. For example, it would impact me in my uh, social anxiety. I have a lot of that and going up against um, people and online did help me a lot to speak to people and do presentations in front of class. And I find myself more confident too. We may not know much about Courts of Mock Trial, but we do know they have a strong ambition and desire to succeed. I advise you all to keep an eye out and let's see how they succeed in the upcoming year. Welcome back, Royals. Hey, Robert, why don't they play poker in the jungle? I don't know why. Because there's a lot of cheetahs. <laughs> wow, that would mean they're lying. We'll be right back after a quick PSA. Hang tight, Royals. Nice to see you again, Royals. Here's some community announcements. 
This Saturday, October 8th, Lancaster's Harley Davidson is holding the 12th annual Ride to End Violence. This is an event to show support to victims of domestic violence. To start the event, a poker run will be held at Crazy Autos on 20th Street West from 8 to 10 a.m. There will also be a car show from 9 to 10 a.m. at AV Harley Davidson, and then a finish line party and car show from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. at Harley Davidson. Poker and the first car show both cost $25 each. We hope to see you there. Hey guys, are you interested in an art and music festival? Then come join the Kaleidoscope Festival that is being hosted Saturday, October 8th from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. This festival will be hosted on, at the Palmdale Amphitheater, and don't worry about admissions or parking. Both are free. The amphitheater is located at 2723 Rancho Vista Boulevard, Palmdale, California. We hope to see everyone there. Now, now let's, let's look, look at some, some interesting, interesting facts. facts. Did you know that the Twitter bird is actually named Larry? I had no idea about that, and it is really exciting for me. I, oh, it brings me a lot of joy. Did you know that the lady in the Mona Lisa is actually named uh, Gerard, Mona Girardini? Wow. Or that, Lisa Ger Girardini. That doesn't make any sense. Make any sense. They should have named painting something else then. I agree. Well, thanks so much for sticking with us, Royals. I'm Robert Watts. And I'm Terry Mueller. This, this has, has been, been the Quartzal Update. update.